rougher for them knuckles. The best of them, tougher than knuckles. You can call me knuckles, unlike knuckles. I don't chuckle. I'd rather flex my knuckles. I'm hard as knuckles. It ain't hard to chuckle. I break them down. No, but like, uh, like they're all in the same group, like talking about how uh, excited they are for uh, Voldemort to come back, and they're all like, yeah, I fucking hate all these uh, non-pure wizarding families, and it's, oh man, I just don't get it. It's like, why would you even have, why would you be encouraging this? Why would you allow this to happen? Which really makes me wary of people that are like, Proud Slytherin. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> like, there's, okay. You can. Sorry, Rona. Rona is a Slytherin, right? But she, like. No, but there's, like, what would actually be a Slytherin, which is someone who's uh, ambitious and working towards goals. And, sure, which Rona is, I think. Uh, but there's also. But, like, Calling Rona, you out, Rona. <laughs> but there's not, like. There's not a, necessarily a scumbag. Oh, this is the level that took you yeah, five weeks to be. This is where I'm gonna lose nine lives. Uh. And then you're finally gonna be happy. We're gonna lose it on the last level and leave it just up to everybody's imagination. <laughs> <laughs> knuckles. It's back to Knuckles. Many fucking Knuckles, a Titanic Monarch! That's the name of this level. Oh, that's a pretty good fucking it's name. It's a sick name, it's not your name. Uh, what was it? Red Action? Yeah. I'm on stage, Red Action. Rusty Dream. Uh, Maybe this will be easier to get through with knuckles. You think so? I don't know. Oh, you that one little section that you couldn't jump up, you might be able to just climb. Yeah, this is very true. Except it probably won't be that way. Yeah, probably won't. No, but like in the books, they're just the, just all like they're just all bad. There's not yeah. even the minor ones are still like garbage people. Yeah, and I I don't get it. Like not a single one stays to help out when, during the battle of uh, Hogwarts. Like, they're all just passively, like, Death Eaters? And, like, into, like, that whole... the whole steeze? <laughs> I'm into that Death Eater, uh... Nazi sort friend. of, uh, representation, uh, steez. It's really into the culture. Yeah, like, why can't I celebrate wizard culture? What, what's grosser than... What, what really grosses me out, I get that people um, deal with difficult things differently, but it really grosses me out when people compare it to um, the full-on bullshit that is today, uh, when they compare it to Harry Potter shit. People, I have not seen that. On Twitter it happens, occasionally, like, Those... oh my god, Trump is a literal Voldemort, and like, oh, this oh is like, no. this is like the Battle of Hogwarts, the no. way people are being treated, and it's like, y'all, y'all need to stop, like, yep, fandoms are not the way to... Like, it's, it's, it's okay to cope using that sort of thing, but, like, don't don't, don't... don't don't make that your message. Right, yeah? Like, oh we all gotta cope, get it, but, like... No, Trump is not Voldemort, Petrificus you know what I mean? Well, it's obvious. <laughs> but you can still tell, it seems like... <laughs> I was, I was about like to say, is a... that a Molotov that yeah. petrifies? Wouldn't you use that? Doesn't that seem like the best it seems like a Borderlands weapon. What? A Borderlands weapon. No. Uh, well, Petrificus of Tatatalus seems like uh, the most... Okay, as, as bad as... as uh, okay, so, like, going back, none of this world makes sense, because memory erasing charms are perfectly legal. In fact, like, love potions are legal and sold to children. Yeah, like, but, there's... like, your kid will be fucked up in the years, you know? Yeah. So like, you know, like it's it's bad, but you know. But it's legal. Ah, oh. Thought I thought I could get in fast enough. That's okay. <sighs> like people crack my back. People throw away memory charms. Like it sticks a gum. Huh. Can you Can I not think about this for half a second? I don't like being careful. Well that's the most terrifying thing in the world. Yeah, for sure. And Hermione's just like, what? She, like, does that to her parents, which, I mean, was, like, a super dire situation that would have, that, that, like, you know, that affected her in a lot of ways. But, like, the way other people just, just, there's, like, no, it's, like, this there's, like, there's no, there's no, uh, punishment. <laughs> yeah. Fuck me. 
Like, uh, no, Kingsley time. Shacklebolt. Uh, and Sick Aura. name. Sick fucking Sick name. name. It's a cool dude, too. Uh, uses it on a girl so uh, Harry Potter doesn't get in trouble. He does it to lie to the government. Sometimes you gotta lie to the government. I don't know, but like... Ah, man, it's just... Umbridge is the government. Let's lie to Umbridge. And then carve it into your skin. Oh, man. Do you know what, uh... Do you know that thing about her and the centaurs? Did she fuck us? Oh, no, no, no. They they really hated her, right? Well, Did they, like, leave her in the forbidden forest to die or some shit like that? No. Uh, in Greece, the thing about centaurs is, uh... One, they're really good at archery. Yes. To they're really into fucking anything they can grab. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As is the mythological Greek way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, archery and fucking. Uh, so that's. People assume that that's what, uh, happened to. to Umbridge in the forest. She got shot and then fucked? Yeah. They're just a tribe of. of. of centaurs. Yikes. I, but someone had to point <laughs> this that is out a, to this me. Is, if you could, it, at this point in the video, insert that picture of Marge with the kids in the backseat saying, Kids, could you lighten up a little bit? No, that would I'm be not, really good. No. I'm just... It's really the Hank Harvey things. No, me but too, like, also, as well. Like, I know it's a kid's book, but that was no, like, it's a kid's not, book. Though. Like, it was like, like, it's, it's, it's a kid's y series. It's YA, but like... If, but everybody's gotten something out of it, right? Like, adults were reading it when it came out. It's not just People a, like... People were writing uh, college courses. Yeah. Like, I, I feel it's... like saying it's a kid's book kind of... It, it's not insulting. What's the word I'm looking for? It kind of minimizes it a little bit. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's not yeah, no, just I can't think of the word that you're trying to use. But, but you get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Belittling it? Yeah, kind of. Uh, demeaning it? A little bit, yeah. There's there's a there's a specific word I'm trying to... it? <laughs> yep, disembigning it. That's a, that's a perfectly prominent one word. Oh, this is that zone that you hate. It's yep. Climb on that wall. Right? I don't think I can, but I'm gonna... See what I can do. Oh, what if you just want it? What if you just do it? What if you just do it right now? Close. Ah, uh, maybe I can just. Does what? that go all the way up? Nice. There we go. <laughs> nice. That literally took you hours yesterday. It did not take me hours yesterday. It took me, it took hours me a half yesterday. hour probably. It took you four okay. half hours. Okay. Are you gonna help me or? I don't know what to do here. Other we got We gotta hit. We gotta hit this build up here. Yeah. Why don't you stop being in the middle and just let me do it? Cause I don't take it and lose all. Okay, the do you? Oh, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Waiting on you to do it. Try it. Do it. Why aren't you doing it? I don't know. Why aren't I doing it? Ah, <laughs> oh, hey, you did it once. Now do it like four more times. Are little spikes flying out of something. Oh, those. I also- I, I make fun of Hufflepuff too, I do, but I also don't like that people are like, Nah, all Hufflepuffs are fucking stupid. It's like, aw, I know some good Hufflepuffs. You have to be smart if you work real hard. It's true! Sometimes, it's true. A good work ethic will trump brains a lot of the time, I feel. Do I not able to jump as high? What's up with that? I don't know. Oh, it's because we're going up. Probably. You hear those cicadas outside? Yeah, Are our windows closed? Should we? It's a loud cicada. Yeah. Is it just like in our house? Is that the problem? It's like up my nose? Stupid Holy shit. Stupid mobile oh, boy. I got it. There we go. Nice. We're all mobile boys. You're not watching YouTube. <laughs> You're a mobile boy. You know what I mean? You're all diamonds. Like, I don't know how they made, uh, I don't, I don't know how they made college courses off of Harry Potter when so little of it, like, holds up. The magic of Harry Potter is that people can read into it and multitude of ways. Yes. Name five ways. Name five of the multitude. Uh, people on Twitter are like, yep, Trump's Hitler, and that's how I'm reading into it. Or Trump's Hitler. Trump's Voldemort, and that's how I'm reading into it. Also, Hitler's Voldemort, and that's how I'm reading into it. Ugh. Guys, I don't think I didn't think Hitler was bad until I found out about Voldemort. Did I just make? Did I just um, understood? You're saying it wrong. It's Voldemort. Shut up. It's 
like how Tom Holland says peace on Beckley. Really leave Tom Holland alone, he's a sweet boy. He's got a frog in his mouth. He's got a frog in his mouth, he's gotta protect it though. Tom, he's just about it. He's supposed to go down, right? Yep. I mean, I have zero to do here, so... Yep, just leave it to me. I did this a million times last night, so I should be okay at it by now. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Actually. So, if, uh, Harry Potter world, uh, was, uh, the, the Sonic the Hedgehog world, what do you think Sonic would... <laughs> I can't believe this is a conversation that's happening. What house do you think Sonic would get sorted into? Sonic is clearly a Gryffindor, yeah. Knuckles is a Hufflepuff, <laughs> Tails is a Ravenclaw. Amy's a Slither. Nah, Amy's probably a Hufflepuff, too. She's think... very loyal to Sonic. Was that true? Yeah. Um, of course, since all Slytherins are pure evil, Robotnik is a Slytherin. Oh, what if he was just like a Ravenclaw girl? No, he's totally a Slytherin because he does have, like, a uh, thirst for power. Shadow the Hedgehog would have difficulty deciding whether, um, the Sorting Hat would have difficulty deciding whether he was a Gryffindor or a Slytherin. You think so? Probably He's Shadow brave enough to go his own way. Yeah! But, <laughs> but he, uh, he's got such ambition. What what do you think would be different about the story if uh, Harry Potter got sorted in the Southern? It'd be more interesting. You think so? If he was not in the I'm Brave house, if he had to like kind of rise against his shitty peers, I think that would be more interesting. There's like very little intra house friendships, which sucks because it's like I think she realized that and introduced Luna Lovegood for. The, I'm gonna say a hundred pages she features in the entire series. Oh my god. Um, there's like very little. Like, they even specifically put two of the classes together in like all the classes. Mm -hmm. I mean, two of the houses together in the classes. But he does, Harry Potter doesn't like hang out with any Hufflepuffs. Cedric died. He yeah, looks like he hung out with Diggory for a hot minute. Not really. But like, Cedric died. And Cedric was the coolest Hufflepuff there. He tried but, to give a show. And, yeah, he right. He likes a Ravenclaw uh, girl. He does. Uh, which is why I wanted him with Luna. But, um... Like, after I would have rather had him with Cho, honestly. No. Uh, I feel like Cho gets a bad rap. I did super really enjoy... I remember... I have a very clear memory of, of reading... that date being so awkward. The most, <laughs> the most like, awkward thing our teenage minds could... I was like in my bed reading the at like four in the morning the same like the the morning after I bought it just having been read it for like Fuck, that forever one. for that whatever that day was and uh, just like losing my mind at how horrible that was. I feel like a lot of people think like oh, she's kind of, she was kind of a like bitch to Harry. No, and, no, 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 not at and all. she was dealing with her just her dead fucking boyfriend. <laughs> like yeah, that's she. She dealt with Cedric dying by uh, crying and being very emotional, and he dealt with it by being angry for an entire book. Yeah. And then uh, when book six starts up, he's a lot less angry, even though Sirius just fucking died. So I don't know what to. I don't know what to make of that. Same. Um. Uh. Yeah. So once Everybody once Cedric differently. once Cedric dies, uh, you get Zachariah Smith, and he's a super shitbag. Like, he's in the Dumbledore's army, but then, like, just starts shitting all over Harry Potter and the Gryffindor team when like, he's a Quidditch commentator. Like, oh yeah, Ron and Ginny, his best friends, I guess they're on the team. I guess I know what it takes to get into Gryffindor. Weasley's our team, our king, though, you know? Oh my gosh. Uh, I've been listening to the audiobooks, and, um, Stephen Fry reads it. Melodious. When he sings that, it is. But so... do you feel a little harassed by his voice? <laughs> I said that it was so weird. But, oh my <laughs> god, are you kidding? <laughs> no, but like when he sing sings the Weasleys are King thing, and I don't know if this is like a. Oh, has he? You've gotten to that point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So he sings that Weasley is our king. He cannot save a single ring. He sings it like that. Which I don't know if that's like that's the not British. Singing. That's spoken word. <laughs> yeah, that, that's like some. Uh, William Shatner nonsense. And I don't know if that's just how, like, the British football teams do their chants. So it sounds super weird from an American standpoint. 
Which I guess I can only really think of as like cheerleaders. Which is probably a super American concept anyway. Uh, but that just sounds so... It doesn't sound good. It doesn't sound... I don't know if that's just his delivery or if that's like a culture thing, you know? Sure. Because in America it would be like, uh... Uh... You, G-L-Y. You ain't got no alibi. <laughs> you you ugly. ugly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ugly. I can't remember any of the other ones. Be aggressive. Be, Be uh, aggressive. aggressive. I thought about going after a uh, cheerleading for one year in middle school. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Then you went acting Just because I was so willfully picked on. Aww. <laughs> yeah. Oh, poor baby. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe I can make friends this way. Nope. Spooky reading, girl, no. But I, I didn't try out. I was like, I'm really not about... I don't care about football or sports <laughs> in are you general. Gonna, how are you going to get a uh, football boyfriend unless you're a cheerleader? I wanted Harry Potter. I wanted the guy that snuck into the. Uh, I wanted Edward Cullen. The high Cullen. GPA picture in the yearbook. <laughs> That's me. You think people get that? Uh, do you think people like realize that Harry Potter is like a fucking jock and was captain of the football team? No, but he wore glasses and he was misunderstood. No, he get it. He was, he was misunderstood. Let's go. Oh, you almost fucked it up. Uh, but let's. Knuckles is our king. <laughs> <laughs> he gets all the golden rings and then she fucks it up. Fuck you, Andy. Cannot play a single thing. She drops all the rings. Mandy is our king. No, but that's just. That doesn't sound like a good chant, right? No, it doesn't. I wonder. I wonder what direction he was given for that. I don't know. I like that. I wonder if he was given direction for that is maybe a better way to phrase that. Well, apparently, uh, because he had like trouble saying like a certain phrase, Harry pocketed it. Uh huh. Like so. Could you know that story? No. Okay, so apparently this is apocryphal. Um. Uh, at a party, mm -hmm. Stephen Fry met. Uh, J.K. Rowling, okay. and she goes, "Oh yeah, I'm a, I'm an author for a kids book." And he goes, "Oh, that's good for you." Oh my god! And then he gets uh, hired to, to audiobook that, and uh, I feel like he's kind of a shitbag. Like people like him, but I feel like he's not a great guy. I could be wrong. He's, he's got a lot going on. I think he's also bipolar. Oh yeah. Or, well. sorry. Well, oh, there's a better, there's a more PC phrase for bipolar. I don't, I, I don't Manic know. Manic depressive. Oh, okay. Uh, I just know that he kind of seems like an asshole in like, a lot of the interviews that I've seen or read about. Going into this with zero rings. That's cool and fun. Um, but he's like, oh, that's good for you. Uh, and then she got to a, he got to a phrase that he just could not say, which was Harry was given something and then Harry pocketed it. Mm -hmm. So he couldn't say pocketed it. Pocketed it. <laughs> no, you can't because you're thinking about it. Okay, yeah. you gotta help me the fuck out with this guy. Yeah, yeah, just stay out of the way. Vines get all electric. I know, I know, I watched you fail over and over, so I, I kinda know what's going on. The whole time I was like, why is Manny's having such a hard time with this? Oh well, it went after you. Gotta go after somebody. Uh, so, Gotta nuke somebody. So, he had a hard time with it, right? Mm -hmm. So, she just said, okay. You, he's like, can I change the line? He goes, no, you cannot change the line. It has to be as written. So yeah. he had to like... <laughs> it's an audiobook, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, uh, he... She forced him to say it, and then she included that line in every book. Sometimes multiple times. <laughs> and if you don't think that's the line of I love shit, it so much. <laughs> like, fuck you. Yes, me. Joe, like, yes. Fuck you. Also, even if he does have an impression or something, it doesn't you still get, don't get to be a dick excuse to, Yeah, exactly. Ooh, She's yeah. got way more money than you now. Let's see if they can just- oh. I no, we, we can't. I, I, I tried, like, for a good solid minute yesterday and just not catching those hints. So, okay. uh... <laughs> so I assume, uh, his little sticker- oh, we can just get him up oh. in the air? Fuck! Actually, if we just avoid him twice, Oh, really? Yeah, I was trying to avoid him, I was not actually trying to go after him. Oh, okay. So if you just avoid him twice, then you'll get sent back to the main zone. But that's sure, okay. Sure. This this fight actually is not hard. 
don't know. I've I just I, I just would get here with only one life, so I would have to redo both acts of the previous thing and then be back here, and I would still only have one life except for that miraculous time where I had more than one life. Oh, hey, by the way, is, um... Mm -hmm. Uh, what did... Did I just disappear? Yeah. I did. That fucking sucks. Um... Uh, when it does all the alerts uh -huh. at the top of the screen... It doesn't mean anything. No, is that like a... Is that like the same alert message that you get for, uh, Evangelia? I mean, it looks like an alert, so I guess. Huh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no! <laughs> Uh Look at his little fingies. That's... <laughs> um... I thought I was helping. Oh no, we can't restart. Uh-uh, we can't. Okay. Uh-oh. Let's uh... take a nine-minute break and then come back to it. Because this is the final boss. I'm not just going to nod. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what a hell! <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta take a cap. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh my god! I thought that would stop it. I thought we were be fine. Go, I can't go, believe. Go get go get some water or something. Real okay, quick. We're just, I'm gonna. All right. We'll, we'll we'll be back in a couple minutes. <laughs> oh my god! I'll let you know if like it something happens. That's what? crazy. Dude, Five, four, three. Two, one, and that's how a time over is. What if that kicked us out of the whole game? It would be hilariously devastating. <laughs> okay, so what did we learn? Don't go for both hands. Save a hand for Mandy, okay? Save a handy for my Mandy. Um, <laughs> I'm the one on the left. Okay, you be the one. Okay. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it six more times. Just so we have I'll to... be on the left. You be on the right. You stay there. Keep bouncing on the little guy. Oh, I need to get Bounce. Bounce me. Bounce me. <laughs> okay, so, like, as far as, like, evil villains go, uh -huh. you gotta give him credit for, like, actually getting in the face of it. You know? True! Like, he's. He does want to protect his evil empire, that's for sure. Man, I can't believe that. I can't believe how cool I was. Oh man, maybe you're the coolest. You get one of those fly beams, right? But like, he's always like in a weirdly, <laughs> in a weird suit, with his head poking out. He's an ideas man. He just loves ideas. Oh, when the vines are down, we can just go for it. I know. No, but like from from the other side, I was just like, you know. I was just on this. What if I got them both? <laughs> okay, so this guy we just have to dodge twice. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm out. On you, baby cakes. I think he's done so. Yep. Yeah. Some vulnerability frames, egg butt. Oh. Take that ring. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Where am I looking? We actually we didn't even see all the guys, so we did really good. Yeah, I'm on this team. That looks- that super looks like a, uh... uh Evangelion, sure. Yeah. Why don't we do- is that a third That's Knuckles? A third Knuckles! Knuckles and Knuckles Wait, I couldn't get in. Oh, damn. He was the true Knuckles. I set you up all along. Oh, yeah. Some Who replicant. were you you weren't the true Knuckles? Some replicants. Kind of. Aww. Oh, Aw, cute! I oh, look at those two assholes in the bottom right corner. Sonic Mania and Knuckles. And Knuckles! And Knuckles. <laughs> we hit A, or...? Nah, I'm gonna stare at this image as long as I can. Maybe I hit A. I hit A. 
That's so I it. Guess that's Sonic and Knuckles. We beat it in one sitting. We did really good. We did good. It's mostly me because I got us through the levels and you did the bosses. But yeah. I'm a poor hack fan. I'm associating with the team. Oh my god. Christy White. Oh uh, yeah. But yeah, that was that was Honey's first Sonic game with Knuckles. And Knuckles. And Knuckles and Knuckles. Eh. I actually kind of don't like the White Seems play. But at least you tried. Oh man, I just I just want to get into like a good old fashioned like Call of Duty or Battlefield Hero. or Battle War Man. No, but or... seriously, like this game it seems like, to be it's... same. Like, it seems it's to be so good. Everything you wanted it to be. It's everything I wanted it to be. Well, it was uh, like so said twenty bucks. Like Sonic can be good again. Twenty bucks is so cheap. <laughs> This was twenty dollars, you guys. I don't know. We played through it in thirty hours. Do you think that's worth it? Yes. Could have been faster if we had subs on that. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Music. Chef, the job, Tyson. The bone breaking culture. It's just it's so good and it's it feels good. Except for I, I played a little bit of Tails and Tails is not so easy to see. Do you think that's um just? How that character is supposed to work, or do you think it's really like they didn't program her? Right? Mm, I don't know. Like, I mean, I, I don't want to say they programmed anything wrong. Just like they did well. We, I think we've uh, proven that they didn't program one thing wrong. No. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Are you sure? You can, you can prove it with that, right? That's what people call a bug, and they uh, they do their best to fix. <laughs> well, it didn't happen to me the last time, so. So you're gonna have a super good teammate. I have tails. Wow. Anything else? Any other final words? Um. No, not really. That's just. That's what these credits play out. Uh, so. I was just gonna say, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Come again? Like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> that's not what you said the first time, I don't think, actually. Nickel, comment, and the scribble. Nickel? Nickel? Suckle my knuckle? Nickel, comment, and the scribble. <laughs> oh my god. I think we're out. Do you think we're out? Or do you think that, well, is there an know. after credits I, sequence? For, for and, Captain America? For and Knuckles, I don't know. <sighs> Alright. Okay, just just chill out. Talk to me for like five more I've minutes. I've been talking to you for three and a half hours. I know, it's so weird, right? We're married and talking to each other. I hate it. It's weird. I hate it. Who's Koo? No. SVP. Super valuable person. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's how that goes. I sold you. How much would it be worth? I love um, the 80s pixels they've got going on. You mean just pixels? In this background? No, no, no. But like, it's like 80s shapes. It looks like the jazz design on those uh, like, cups. I like that there's a lot of clean lines, but then the O's and the, and the Q looks real bad. Let's see, it's just jagging you down. Ooh, negative Nancy. What? Negative Nancy, I can't believe it. Look, you make me play all these shitty games. Like Splatoon? Splatoon. I'm not allowed to play Splatoon. I was gonna show a little how Splatoon I am. I was gonna ink all over their faces. Weird. I got an umbrella. So some cool umbrella tricks. Umbrella tricks are strange. <laughs> nah, that's good. It's good. Then why am I making a face about it? It's a good face. <sighs> Real dumb face. Anyhow. But yeah, this game is so, so fun. I'm excited to play through it a few more times also. Uh, we got it on the Switch, of course, so I'm happy that um, I can play it on the plane. Everybody, buy, comment, and subscribe this game. Yes, I highly recommend. I can't believe this credit sequence is still going. I can't, I can't believe I can't believe I had to wait twenty something years for a good Sonic game, and you can sit five minutes through the credits and put being <sighs> a baby. You can sit multiple of five. Oh my god! My legs are tired of seats. Of seats? I'm just tired of Jarvis and his crofts. Yeah. Clinton. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> John say it only. But yeah, this game just does so much right. It feels so good. It feels like my childhood. 
It makes me very happy. It's cool that once you get Sonic away from the owners of Sonic, you can make a good Sonic. Game. Kind of. Kind of. The people who make Sonic what it is don't know how to make Sonic anymore. Give it to any Joe Schmo named Christian. Just give it to the right Christian. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's just... It's so nice! Some fine gold. And you can tell the people that made it like really care about Sonic. Yeah, the soundtrack is amazing. The opening animation is like really good. It's super good. It's super cute. Oh, did you know that Knuckles could read? I thought he couldn't read. <laughs> Do you see that? He's probably maybe a picture, it's a picture book. Yeah, he's describing a picture book. <laughs> so this is me, and I'm punching the wall. <laughs> this is Spot. Spot's running. Maybe yeah. those little those little animals were teaching Knuckles how to read. He's all right, Papa. Do do do. Don't throw it in the fire. Nope. It's good advice for anything, really. Yeah. Uh, uh, the Baba Duke 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 and, um, uh, It Follows. Which do you like better? Um, I like the character of the Baba Duke. Because he's creepy, scary, big smile, LGBT icon. Sure. Um, but I think It Follows is a better movie. Yeah. Great soundtrack. Legit, like, scary. Like, freaked me out. Yeah, so I think I think It Follows. It wasn't really scary, right? It was very moody, and scary shit did happen, but it didn't freak me out like, um, like It Follows did. Just looking behind you. Do you remember, do you remember we started watching that? We sat in the back, and somebody was also watching with us, and within five minutes they just left the theater. Do you remember? No. Yeah. Like, they hadn't even been served their food yet or anything. Oh, wow. Yeah. You just couldn't handle it? I don't remember that. I think it started off with a sex scene. Yeah, it did. Right? Yeah. And I think they were like, sex? No, I don't want no sex in my violence. Try again. He's mocking me with his gross Teddy Roosevelt oeuvre. Okay, that's it. Oh, I've already cut out all of that since there was no after credits. Well, now we can say goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Here I come, rougher than knuckles, the best of them, tougher than knuckles. You can call me knuckles, unlike knuckles, I don't chuckle. I'd rather flex my knuckles, I'm hard as knuckles, it ain't hard to chuckle, I break them down.